Hey babes, welcome and welcome back. It's your girl Midnight Moon and today we're talking post mask skincare. So if you've been wearing a mask because of COVID-19 all year long, then this is for you. This is the Filarina After Mask Skin Oxygen 1000 Trio Set, which contains a gel and a day and a night cream for prolonged mask use. So if your skin's been feeling dehydrated, irritated, maybe even acne prone, mask knee baby, then these products may be really beneficial to you. So if you guys are interested, then just make sure you keep on watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos. Comment and let me know if you guys have a skincare after mask routine. Thumbs up the video and share it with friends and family so they can learn about this trio set too. So without further ado, let's get into it. Put your money on the backseat. Don't give us that paparazzi, baby. You know they always trying to give me a million dollars at the night scene. So first, I do just want to mention this video is sponsored by Filarina and Beauty Tap in exchange for honest reviews. You can check out my review over at beautytap.com for verified expert reviews. So not only is this trio anti-fatigue, but it is also anti-aging and smoothing. And it's also made with three types of hyaluronic acid, which are all different molecular structures to penetrate deep into the skin to actually help calm the skin from whatever is going on with the mask and to preserve the skin's microbiome. These products are made for all skin types. And for reference, I am combination and acne prone. This is more on the high end side, luxury spa care. So if you can afford it, then I'd say go ahead and try it. And this is actually $227, but I am reviewing it off how it went for my experience. So I'm not going to base it off price here. One thing I do have to say is that the day and the night cream, they smell amazing. So if you're someone who typically breaks out from fragrance, or anything scented, then this might not be for you because it has more of that spa smell. I've smelled spa grade products before and these are actually a bit stronger, but I like the way it smells, I prefer it. It doesn't have an effect on my skin and it smells beautiful and it really makes you feel like you're at a spa. I have been using these products for about a week now and I've really been enjoying them. I typically don't wear a mask, so I am basing this off how it went for my acne prone skin. And one other cool thing that I like about these is you could actually use this under your makeup as a primer. So the first product we have is the After Mask Skin Oxygen 1000 Protective Day Cream. And it's made to protect and defend the skin from irritation and stress caused by the mask. It's also plumping and anti-aging. I looked at the ingredients in this and I like the type of ingredients they use. There's shea butter, metal foam seed oil, which are really beneficial for moisture and hydration, as well as allotoin, which is really good for anti-aging. And we have the night cream. I'm going to talk about the gel in a second, but the gel is a weekly treatment. You can use it two to three times a week, depending on your skin, but one time a week is recommended. So going back to the night cream, this is the After Mask Skin Oxygen 1000 Night Calming Cream. And this has squalene and jojoba seed oil. So just to show you the textures because i am going to show you how the gel works because it's really cool but this is the day cream right here and it does leave that dewy complexion and this is the night cream which i feel like is a bit thinner than the day cream but i still really enjoy it it has a nice consistency And again, they smell amazing. They really put you in a trance when you're using them. So like I said, you do use the gel once a week, 
So with this, you do need a clean face. So I am going to go wash my face off real quick and I'll be right back with you guys. So now we're back and this is the bottle. They actually all look like this, but just to give you a little close up. And this is the gel we're going to be using after we cleanse our skin. Don't add anything. Don't add toners. Not a thing. We are going to take the pump and add some gel. I think I just dropped some. Here. So as you guys can see, it's literally a gel. So you just rub this on, make sure it's a thin layer. Wherever you would have your mask, wherever you're having that irritation. And the same thing on the other side. And it's going to start activating the oxygen bubbles and this part is so cool because you're gonna see it bubble up so just give it a second adding a little bit more on the other side you could give it a little massage so it works up the foam and this you see it's coming in, guys. It's coming in. Don't mind me. I'm looking in my monitor to make sure it's foaming and you guys can see it. So you're going to let that sit in for a few minutes while it's bubbling. And then after the couple minutes are up, you are just going to rub it in again so the effect could come back up. See, it's so cool. And you see it's starting to disappear. Right there. It kind of tickles and tingles as the bubbles are going away. Then you can rub it in. And it'll start doing the magic all over again. See that, guys? That is so cool. And it really does feel calming on the skin. It really feels gentle and kind to my acne, my inflammation. Hashtag beard. Now, after you've rubbed it in again, you can pretty much either rub this in the rest of the way or you can wash it off. I am going to wash it off because I'm adding other skincare items. It's not a necessary, it's just something that I prefer to do. And then once I'm done, I will apply the After Mask Night Cream. And that will be to finish off the whole routine. So we have washed it off and that is pretty much it. Once you put your cream on, which we haven't yet, it will give you a beautiful dewy glow. I do have one more video to film, so I'm not going to do that on camera right now. On to my final thoughts. So final thoughts, I think this is a really good treatment. I wouldn't say this is an everyday thing because it is on the high end side. Treatments are usually more on the high end side because you're not supposed to use them as often. And I think for the amount you have to use for each product, it's not a lot. So a little goes a long way and that does save money. It does have a really luxury feel to it, which is something that I really like. I have never been to a spa, but it's always cool to experience that spa feeling at home, especially now during COVID. I think these are really great products for irritation, acne, dehydration, and just tired skin from mask wearing. And I think they would really do good on all skin types. Again, depending on your skin type, you might need the treatment more than once a week, but I really wouldn't recommend using it more than two or three times a week. So my full on review out of five stars, it is five out of five. I have no problem with these products. They don't irritate me. They don't cause more acne. The smell is amazing. And I'm not big on smell. I usually go for unscented products, but I don't mind if they're scented. So this is really not a biggie for me. And they really do leave that nice, soft glow on the skin. So if you guys need a good aftermath skincare, 
then I would definitely recommend this trio set. If you guys do want to purchase this, you can find it down below in the description box where I will have it linked. And that's pretty much it for this video. So let me know your thoughts on this Aftermath trio down below in the comments. Don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up and share the video. Also subscribe if you haven't and hit that notification for more beauty reviews and education. And we will be back here next Thursday as always with another video. You guys stay beautifully awesome.